Music is one of the many forms of art and innovation which falls in the category of intellectual property. Unfortunately, artists like other innovators have fallen prey to piracy and acts of counterfeiting that have led to their works being duplicated for the benefit of others. Zambia, like other countries, has joined the world in celebrating the 2011 World Intellectual Property Day and recognizing the contributions of artists and innovators. A march past was part of the celebrations together with a musical performance and drama at a ceremony graced by Information Minister Ronish Kapasha. National Arts Council Chairman Mulenga Kapoepwe commended government for reviewing legislation that will protect intellectual property, noting that artists have created self-employment through their creative minds. At the same occasion, Park Representative Christopher Mapani underscored the need for improved trademark development, which he said is important in preserving intellectual property. Government representative at the celebrations, Ernish Kaposhat, disclosed that a hologram has been purchased to help companies distinguish counterfeit and genuine products. The government has put in place and enacted laws aimed at protecting the rights and indeed the innovating the inventors and innovators rights for them to enjoy the fruits of that sweat. Protection of products of the creative mind can help Zambia generate revenue from the arts and other scientific innovations just as the US, India and Japan have done. It's anticipated that more clampdowns will be carried out on those propagating piracy in Zambia.